Tonight, a Help Me Hank special report in which we are tracking the COVID-19 vaccines and sharing insider information from experts and those who have been fortunate enough to lock in an appointment. Is there anything you can do to increase your chances of getting the vaccine? Here's consumer investigator Hank Winchester. I've heard from thousands of you who've emailed the Help Me Hank team and you simply want to know what can you do to get the COVID-19 vaccine or maybe book an appointment for an elderly loved one. Well, tonight we have insider information. I think it was n no instruction. It was almost like you felt like you were just in limbo. And was this even really real? Jody Neal is one of the lucky ones. Both she and her 76 year old mother are vaccinated, but the process for both of them was very different. It didn't say what number you were, how many people were ahead of you. So it was just almost like it was still a lot of angst on top of what's already a lot of angst to me. Jody lives in Southfield, but she's a teacher in Detroit. Teachers are eligible to get vaccinated right now. So she called the COVID-19 vaccination scheduling center at 313-230-0505. And things for her moved quickly, very quickly. And when I called, someone picked up about 10 minutes later, they asked me the questions and then they, you know, they gave me the date. For her mother, she spent hours registering her on the Oakland County website with Beaumont Hospital, with her personal physician, and also with Meyer. That was a month ago, and she didn't hear a peep. Then, just this week, this text message with promising news. Her advice to you? I just think you have to be on it for them. We just did every avenue, and um, the save the date was the one that, that, that came back. Valerie Ogletree has been working to get her 94-year-old mother, Nancy, vaccinated. They emailed my sister and I and let us know that she had the ability to sign up for a vaccination. Her mother lives in Oakland County, and she registered her mother with Henry Ford Hospital and was notified within about two weeks that an appointment was now available. So they gave a two-day window, and they give you options of places and times that you can go. So we feel very fortunate that we're able to take her in to get it. So what can you do if you're eligible for a vaccine or you're trying to get one for a senior loved one? If your local health department is offering vaccines, sign up for email alerts. Check the website regularly to search for appointments. If you find one, lock it in. They go fast. If you can call, do so from a landline. Why? Well, some phone systems prioritize calls from landlines. Create an online patient portal at your local health. Be emailed to the account linked to your portal. Ask your personal doctor for advice in navigating the system for your specific health system. Register with Meyer by texting COVID to 75049 or go to the Meyer website. Pharmacies like CVS and Walgreens are expected to get shipments of the vaccine next week. Online signups will begin soon, so check their websites regularly. Most counties are offering appointments except Wayne County. They're telling seniors to sign up through their hospital systems. If they don't belong to a hospital system, they suggest pre-scheduling right now with Meyer. In the city of Detroit, eligible residents can call to sign up for an appointment at the TCF Center. And I know many of you still have concerns and questions about how to get the COVID-19 vaccine for yourself or your loved one. So what we're going to do is we're going to put all the latest information we have available right on our website. Click on Detroit.com. I'm Hank Winchester. Help me, Hank.